Hey guys, Sean Hammond with PremierGuitar.com. We're at Winter Nam 2018 in Anaheim, right next to a lot of noisy cymbals. I apologize, but we do have Tom Jones from TV Jones here, and I'm all sweaty from running because I left my bag over there, so you have to forgive me. But Tom, you have some cool new pickups here, humbuckers, right? We have a Starwood line, a new entry into the Starwood line, the, our humbuckers, PAF style. And my goal was uh, in the neck position, not too dirty and muddy, and the bridge not too bright and brittly. So a uh, very even tone. I hope, I hope you guys enjoy them. Sounded great on the intro there. Um, did you, when you designed these, did you have like a specific set of like holy grail pickups that you were going after, or was it like? I was going after a very musical tone, very dynamic. Um, that was my main thought as, as a musician. As uh, just getting a good feel, right? Was it like a, a combination of tonalities and aspects of different pickups you've played over the years, or was there like one set of pickups you just felt like were your favorite? Or? I would say a, a bunch of pickups and a bunch of guitars that just had the right feel and sound, and and that's what I went for. It wasn't really a specific uh, tone or anything. It was just a well-rounded musical pickup is okay. what I was after. Now, you want to tell us about the construction a little bit? Because when people hear like PAF, they want to know right. if it's like built just like the old ones or, you know, the magnet type and all that. PAFs are usually known to be a, a darker pickup, a little rounder on the top end. So what I did is I wound the coils a little lighter and I added what's called inductance with uh, special screws and keepers and the magnets to kind of bring the, the power up a little bit and a little little fuller that way rather than with magnet wire. Magnet wire can kind of uh, take the high end or clarity away if you have too much of it. So uh, it's kind of a, a simple new design with... And are they like a combination of Alnico's, like two or five or I don't know? It's kind of a special blend I had uh, made up. In of different Alnico's? Or yeah, and the screws are special. It's a proprietary formula, isn't it? Yeah, like Jack in the Box, or am I allowed to say that? What's that? Jack in the Box, like their uh, secret <laughs> sauce. Is, oh. yeah. I'm sorry. And, and the pole screws, those are a special alloy I use. And well, should we have Chris here, who's been in many videos with us before? Should we have Chris play something else? He was doing some jazzy yeah. stuff. At the beginning, was that just the neck pickup? Let me tell you, here's a little pointer I've discovered with uh, PAFs and humbuckers. I've been playing a long time. Half tone will give you that jazz tone. It's all in the tone knob if you have a good humbucker. These sound like PAFs. If you turn a PAF up, it's got a lot of bite to it. That's the same setting with full tone. This is what I had a minute ago. So you just roll the tone back. Just roll the tone down, and that's how a humbucker should behave. Something I should have known many years ago. But anyway. Here it is with a full tone uh, rhythm picker. Here's both pickups. Here's the uh, here's the rear. Twang. I don't know if it's just the way Chris is playing, or but it was, it's almost like Telly style. Yeah, exactly. So we're going to do a little dirty and dirtier and okay. see what you guys think. Do you want to, are you saying you want to change the amp settings or? What do you want to do, Chris? I say twang, that is not a thin twang. Let's do some uh, overdrive. Um, we got Billy Zoom's amp. Let's kick it on the low right. water setting. It's got, uh, you're going to hear a little bit of overdrive. It's just amp and, and amp and straight guitar. Okay. 
really nice clarity there. Yeah, nice clarity. Rhythm pick up again. Now, do you want to just put more dirt on it? See how it sounds? Okay, we're going to put an overdrive pedal on it now. We're going to put an overdrive pedal on. OCD. Oh, sweet. from Heartbreaker a little bit in there? Do the rip, do the rip. He wants you to do the rip from Heartbreaker. Nice. So these are called the Starwood? Starwood humbuckers. That's right. Plain and simple. Sweet. How much are they going for? 140 a pickup and um, 145 for, with a cover, so we do them without covers. Add five for gold, so that'd be uh, 150 for gold. And if you want four conductor, then that's another five. So uh, roughly a base price of 140. Perfect. Sweet. Thanks for playing, Chris. Good to see you, man. Tom, do you want to tell people where to go online to read all about this stuff? Correct. Uh, TVJones.com. Sweet. Thanks, guys. Sean Hammond for PremierGuitar.com.